Uh, I just want to start with, I've seen all of MacGruber and I've seen a few episodes of 1883 and uh, it's just been great to enjoy your work, uh, especially just, I just want to say congrats on both series. Um, I am curious, you've done so many awesome roles. If someone has actually never seen anything that you've done, what is the first thing you want them watching and why? Wow. That's something I've never thought of. I guess it depends on how much they're going to watch. You know, if that makes any sense. If they want to watch it all, then they ought to start in the beginning. Where you know, played a role in a movie called Away West, the role of an extra. When I went to college up in Oregon at the U of O, I worked on this show called The Way West, and it was actually about a journey on the Oregon Trail. That was my first job in a movie business. I was I was kind of soft in the background and walking behind this wagon that Sally Field was sitting in. So that was a long time ago. I don't know. You know, I've got favorite pieces. Maybe Star is Born, maybe Conagher, which is a Louis L'Amour thing that I did with my wife a long time ago. You know, they're all, there's a number of them that are special and there's a number of them that are completely forgetful. You know, some that, you know, I, certainly today I wish I'd never done maybe on some level, but that said, I, I shouldn't even have said that. I don't think there's anything that I wish I hadn't done. I think that there's some work that I'm certainly not so proud of that early on, but it's all a kind of a continuum, you know. In the early days, I would have done anything to work because it's, you know, it's like going to school. It wasn't about the money, it was about doing the work. And I, I discovered early on and made a very conscious decision not to do everything that came my way forever. I wasn't motivated by money and it wasn't in the business to make money. So when I decided that, I, I, I had the ability to be selective about what kind of stuff I did. And if, if the material wasn't there, then I didn't see any point in getting involved in it. I think as soon as you start working for money and you just do a job because it's there, that, that's when people get tired of looking at you. So I don't know. Not I, much of an uh, answer for your question, but... No, yeah. I actually think... You I think it's a very good answer, actually. And it, it says, uh, but I agree at the beginning of your career, you're going to take anything you can get because it's the experience. It's what made, it's what made you who you are today. Yeah. And it leads, uh, you know, work, work leads to work. Work gets work. You know, one of the things watching the series is that it's, it's not a soundstage show. This is all on location. And I, I have to imagine this was an incredibly challenging shoot. Can you sort of talk about the be like the behind the scenes of making this series? Yeah, it still is. We're still at it. We're still in production and we'll be to like mid January, even though we're going to start streaming in another week or 10 days, whenever the 19th comes up, which is even hard to wrap your head around in some ways. It's been, it's been very difficult. I know when Taylor first gave me this opportunity, he told me, you're going to fucking hate me by the end of this thing. And he was talking about the journey, the conditions, the what it was going to be like making a film. I'm certainly not going to hate him because of it, but it's definitely what he promised. You know, we, we started out outside of Fort Worth, Texas, and the end of August, working in 107, 108 degree weather. Everybody's wearing wool clothes. You know, it was brutal. And, you know, we're in the sun and there's no getting out of it. We did that for six or seven weeks. Then we went up to Montana and worked in, you know, surrounded by snow-capped mountains and, you know, weather in the teens, you know, with a chill, with a chill factor. So it's been an interesting. We got blown off the set over in Amarillo the other day with a, in a dust storm that just shut the company down. You know, so it's it's... It's been difficult. It hasn't been an easy shoot. It hasn't been an easy shoot for the cast or the crew. It's probably harder on the crew and the horses and everybody else than it, it has been for us, you know. 
but I think what matters is what's on the screen in the end and they're getting beautiful stuff. They're really getting beautiful stuff and I'm proud to be part of it. Great I already got to stop. Part of it. I was going to say, I already have to stop. I'm just going to say it looks fantastic on the screen. It looks like you guys are putting in the time and energy to make something special. I know it'll be a hit. Um, yeah. Thank you for your time. Thank you for yours. Appreciate it.